Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel Edmond Mindaros and for today's quick tutorial and I'm going to show you guys on how to resolve no internet connections problem or no internet and Windows 10 computer. So this is a common issue that can be caused by a variety of factors from a simple loss cable to more complex software or hardware problems and the issue can affect both Wi-Fi and wired internet connections. And common causes include router or modem issues, internet service provider outage, and correct settings, outdated or corrupted drivers, physical connectivity, software conflicts, and Windows glitches. And then I'll show you simple step to fix this error. And without further ado, and let's go ahead. So the first solutions we will do is to run the network troubleshooters. So all you have to do is to click on a search menu and then here you need to type this troubleshoot settings and then you need to click open and once you open up here a troubleshoot settings on on right side and then you need to click this additional troubleshooters and then here now at additional troubleshooters here at left side navigation panel underneath here at get up and running then you need to tap this internet connections and then again, you can see now this run the troubleshooters and then click. Then we need to wait to complete the detecting problems. So here we need to select in which options would you like to troubleshoot the internet problems. So please select the issue windows should troubleshoot. So we have two options here like troubleshoot my connections to the internet. Help me connect to a specific web page. So it depends on your preferences on how to troubleshoot the internet problems. So for example, you need to select this help me connect the specific web page and then click. And then here you need to enter the address of the website you want to access. So for example here at www.microsoft.com. So here in box, then you type or enter here the web address. And then once you enter here this a website address, then here you need to tap or click this next to proceed and follow the prompt instructions to fix this error. Okay, so after here, and then we need to close. And the next solutions that we're going to do is to check your network adapter. So all you have to do is to right click on the start menu. And then you need to select this device manager. And once you open up here at device manager, and then you need now to select this network adapters. So click this arrow to expand. Then you need to select your network adapter. So check if you need to update or uninstall or install the driver. So this is my Wi-Fi driver here. So all you have to do is to select and then right click. Then you need to tap this update driver. In updating driver, so we have two options like search automatically for drivers and then browse my computer for drivers. Then we need to tap this search automatically. And the best drivers for your device are already installed. Okay, then we need to close. Then if you want to uninstall or reinstall, so same procedure. So all you have to do is to select and then right click and then select this properties. So here now at the graphics properties, then you need to select or tap this driver tab. And then here, if you want to update the driver, then click roll back the driver, disable device or uninstall device. And then next, you need to click this. Okay. Alright, so after here at device manager and the next solutions that we're going to do is to reset the TCP slash IP and flash DNS. So all you have to do is to click on a search menu and then you need to type the CMD or this is the command prompt and then you need to tap this run as administrator. If you receive user account control and then click yes. And once you open up here at administrator command prompt and then we need to type and enter this command keyword. N A T S H space when sock space reset. So just type this command keyword N A T S H space when sock space reset. And then you need to press enter and successfully reset the when sock catalog. Then we need to restart this computer in order to complete the reset. And then after that, then again we need to enter this command keyword IP config space slash slash dns okay so just type this command keyword ip config space slash slash dns that is one word and then press enter 
and successfully flash the DNS resolver cache. And then after completing to enter this two command keyword, and then we need to close the CMD. And then here at the bottom right corner, then we need to click this power button here. Then we need to restart this PC. Alright, so that's it guys and thanks for watching. And please don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel for more quality content. Thank you guys and see you in my next tutorials.